So from the verse. Okay, so that's D, G, 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 B, A, G, A, D, G, 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 B, A, G, A. Next part. That's B A G G B D E. So the next part. That's E D B B G A G A. E D B B G A G A Put that all together That's B A G E E D G. And that's the entire verse from the beginning. D G G G B A G A B A G A G B D E. E D B B G A G A B A G E E D G. So that's the entire verse. Now to the chorus. That's E D. B B G A G A right Next part E D B B D E So for the next part we repeat the first line of the chorus Right from the top of the chorus, it will be. Repeat the first part of the chorus. Right? Good. Then the last line. That's B A G E E D G. Actually, go play a chord. You could harmonize your G here with a B. Or with a low D. Right? Whichever sounds better. Okay, so let's try the whole chorus. Okay, 
So let's play it all the way from the top. So in this section, I'm just going to give you a few, a few notes to harmonize the chorus a bit. So if you remember from the chorus we had. We had harmonized the last the last note of the chorus with the with B, but we're gonna try to harmonize the entire chorus, right? Okay, so what we'll be doing we'll be using our we were using one hand to play the melody, and then the other hand is gonna play the harmony along with it. So for the first line, remember it was. up to there so for that part of the melody we'll try to roll G with it right so I'm gonna play E by itself right and then when I get to the D I'm gonna start rolling the G see I kind of you continue rolling the G right After that, we're going to add F sharp now. Alright. The F and the G might sound a little dissonant, but we're just going to make a quick passing. So try to touch the notes a little lightly. <laughs> So after we roll for the F sharp, we're going to go back to G and we roll on the G, right? F sharp. This time, we're going to roll C. Now I am playing a high C tenor pan, so my C is high. <laughs> um, if you're playing a high C, you could play a C on the outside. If you're playing a low C, you can play a C on the, the C on the outside would be perfectly fine. You could just play your regular C on the outside. If you, for some reason, like the way that this high C songs and you have a low C pan, then just play a C on the inside. C. Gonna go back again, add in the G. F sharp. Right? But this time we're gonna do B and F sharp together. To A and E flat. To E and G. Right? B and F sharp. A and E flat. To E and G. So going from the from the beginning of the chorus again. F sharp. Back to G. C. Mm -hmm. Start over. Alright. 
Forget who we was, the starting over, we was repeating the first line, right? Now we're going to play the B and F sharp, A and E flat, E and G. And then to finish the few lines of the song, we're going to stay on the E and the G, D and F sharp, G and B. G. F sharp. C. G. F sharp. B and F sharp. D and F sharp. G and B. 